So we're now going to start looking at um, evolutionary game theory. And so uh, what we're going to start out by considering is when we have an infinite population of players. So we have infinite players, and these players actually represent strategies. And we're going to start off pretty slow, and the first thing we're going to look at is uh, reproduction, because obviously we're talking about evolution, and kind of the initial step of that is uh, how we get from one generation to the next. And we're just going to start off super slow and just consider uh, a very simple model of population growth. So let's say we have x of t um, be the size of population at, at time t, and we have uh, a to be um, a growth rate. Growth rate. Okay. Now, um, once we do that, it's a growth rate per population size, and so we can write down that the rate at which the population goes up is simply proportional to the size of the population itself. And then maybe going back a couple of years to solving this differential equation, this gives us that x of t has general solution x naught e to the a t, where x naught is whatever the value um, of x was at the beginning of the population. And that's a very simple model of exponential growth. We here, here just have a, a scaled version of the exponential curve, and so um, this is reproduction. And what we're going to now do is build onto this to consider other aspects uh, that will feed into evolutionary game theory.